This is a demonstration video showing the reduction of copper oxide using hydrogen gas. In this video we're going to use a glass pipette as our reduction tube. So firstly we add some glass wool into our tube to stop our pad from escaping. So we poke this down to one end. And now we add some black copper 2 oxide which we happen to have created in the previous video into the tube. Now we connect our reduction tube to our hydrogen supply. The hydrogen in this experiment is being supplied via electrolysis of water. And we clamp that in there. After hydrogen has been flowing through the tube for about 30 seconds, we now light the end to safely burn it off. Now using a Bunsen burner, we now heat the copper oxide. What you will see after a short time is water starting to condensate on the end of the tube. This is of course the reaction product from the hydrogen reduction of the copper 2 oxide, being water. After a little more heating you will see the black copper 2 oxide change colour to become more red. This is because the copper oxide is losing its oxygen and becoming metallic copper. So after another minute or two we've turned our Bunsen burner off allowed our material to cool and turn our hydrogen supply off and removed our reduction tube from the system. So let's see what we've got. We'll tap this out. And what we can see here is metallic copper powder. So we have successfully reduced our copper oxide using hydrogen gas. Thanks for watching.